It's a he said, she said battle that has a small town caught in the middle of this controversy. Tonight, the Edwards County Sheriff is facing off with the Rock Springs School District Superintendent. News 4's Lauren Lee was at tonight's meeting and has the details on this face off new tonight. It's becoming a war of words here, with both the superintendent and the sheriff pointing the finger at each other. Meanwhile, parents say they're worried about their children's safety. I will not be holding to tyranny. Edwards County Sheriff Pam Elliott took on Rock Springs ISD Superintendent David Velke and directly addressed the board at tonight's meeting. She was backed by about two dozen supporters, and both she and the superintendent acknowledged the growing tension. We recently had a case where a teacher had stolen some valuable furniture items from the school and we reported it to the law enforcement and we were told it was a civil matter. If it was placed in the trash, she retrieved it, y'all gave it to her, and then now you want me to go collect some, that's civil matter, I'm not gonna, that's no criminal charges there. Velke accused Sheriff Elliott of making disparaging remarks about board members, which she denies. She says she's gotten complaints from six district employees who claim they're being intimidated by Velke. He says he hasn't gotten any such complaints. And tonight, parents express concerns about deputies allegedly not being allowed on school grounds. I have never said that the deputies cannot be on campus, so that is that is inaccurate. I'm still going on campus. I'm going to protect the kids regardless if David Velke, the school superintendent, approves or not. Velke says he has filed a complaint about Sheriff Elliott with the Texas Commission on Law Enforcement. Meanwhile, Sheriff Elliott confirms there is an investigation involving the superintendent about an alleged illegal school board meeting on July 23rd, which could have violated the Open Meetings Act. However, Sheriff Elliott says she has requested another agency handle that investigation. In Rock Springs, Lauren Lee, News 4, San Antonio.